Hey, what's up guys? It's Coach Ben from Soccer Entrepreneur. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about the type of equipment that you need if you're going to be a soccer coach or if you're going to have your own private training academy, whatever it is you want to do. I'm going to talk about the best ways to save money. This way when you get started, you're not in the hole like how I see a lot of people uh, when they first start. So I'm just going to break this down very easy, very simple. And I'm going to kind of take you back seven, eight years of how it was for me. Um, at the beginning, I thought that I needed to have a bunch of stuff because I saw other trainers out there. They had soccer goals. They had tons of awesome soccer balls, the best cones, training ladders, all these like little gadgets and stuff that look cool. Um, and when I started looking online or even going to some soccer stores, I started to realize how expensive all that stuff was at the beginning. Um, and so what I did was I kind of did the opposite. And that's generally what I do when I see anyone doing, or a lot of people doing one thing, I always do the opposite. Um, and so I started to think of how can I do this as smart as possible way with literally spending either the least amount of money or spending no money at all. And the way that I figured it out was very simple. Um, and I just went to a local soccer store and I told them that I wanted to create a partnership with them. This way, any player who comes through my academy, I can recommend uh, that soccer store for them. This way, that store is going to get free business from me and I can have their soccer store on my newsletter. I can have them on my website. I can promote them whenever I want. And in exchange for that, I can get free equipment. So I could get free cleats, free cones, free soccer balls. And those are the three essential things that you need. Maybe you don't have to have cleats um, if you're coaching a team, but I like to have cleats if I'm training players. But I wanted to have those three things. I didn't need to have a ton of soccer goals and a wall to set up to do for free kicks. Um, I didn't need any of that. And I highly recommend if you want to start a private soccer training business, then you want to do everything at the beginning as cheap as possible. And when you feel like you need to have a goal or you need to have pennies or you need more equipment, great. You can either use my method of going and trying to partner with a soccer store or you can just look online um, and try to find things for cheap. I like going to Amazon or soccer.com, uh, especially when they have promotions like during Christmas, you can find things cheaper there than anywhere else. Um, but at the beginning, you don't need to have a bunch of stuff. And I made another video about this, about how to save money at the beginning when you start your academy. But I felt like I needed to make something more specific about the type of equipment you need. And in reality, I want you to think about kids they don't need to have a bunch of stuff. Stuff is just kind of distractions. So the more stuff you have at your session, it, it might make your session look cool, but that's not going to really help the player develop and get better. If you're just doing footwork drills and different types of passing drills and even shooting drills, you don't have to have a goal. Um, you don't have to have a ton of cones. Um, and you don't even have to have soccer balls because you could just require all the players who you train to bring their own soccer balls. Um, and this is this is where you kind of have to think outside of the box when you start. You don't need to do what everyone else is doing um, because if you're spending between $100 and $500 just right out of the gate when you start, then that's not really a great feeling to have when you're starting to train players, um, especially if you don't have anyone yet. So that's what I recommend. Either partner with the soccer store um, or go look online and just get the things that you need, not the things that you feel like you have to have, but you need the things that you need. This way you can run proper sessions um, and the players can get the most out of every session that you do. So if you like today's video, make sure to click the thumbs up button and comment below. If you have any questions for me, uh, shoot me a personal email at startyoursocceracademy at gmail.com. In the description below this video, you're gonna see a lot of different resources there. I've created a book called The Startup Soccer Academy. I have a uh, mastermind now for different coaches who want my personal one-on-one -on -one help. You can read all, all about that below this video. And once again, if you have any questions, either shoot me a comment below 
or send me an email at startyoursocceracademy at gmail.com. All right, I'll catch you next time.